All right, weather wise, all eyes on beta. What's left of beta and the impacts that it's going to have to Tennessee. It is already pouring rain in some parts of the mid state. It's bone dry in other parts, though. Beta is really going to cut us in half. And if you're in our southern tier, you look to have a very soggy 24 hours. If you are in our northern tier, mostly just clouds for you. So not everyone dealing with the same impacts from the system. The National Weather Service, both here in Nashville and in Huntsville, have issued different flavors of flood watches in effect for our southern tier. So the darker green is a flood watch. The brighter green is a flash flood watch. So different flavors of flooding, but they can manifest in slightly different ways. The timing is tonight through tomorrow, and it is already raining fairly steadily in areas south of Nashville right now. Here's a look at how rainfall totals are going to play out over the next 24 hours. I mentioned how big of a cutoff it is, right? Areas to the north looking at a tenth to two tenths of an inch. Areas south of I-40 are looking at the potential for two to four inches of rain. That's a huge spread. Barely anything in the rain gauge to upwards of four inches from our northern border to our southern border. So if you are south of I-40, be ready for very wet weather. It is already raining south of I-40. There are some showers north. We have no thunderstorm activity right now. It is a steady soaking rain. Flood watches, that darker green I showed you, have to do more with steady rises in water around creeks, streams, low-lying areas. Flash flooding, just that, happening in a flash. So the potential greater for more flash flooding the further south you go because that's where the heaviest rain is now and where it will continue to be. We have pockets of heavy downpours across Hickman County, Murray County, Wayne County. This stretches over into our eastern tier. Some showers making it to areas north of I-40, but in general, the theme for folks north is just clouds, and that's mostly how it will stay. The remnants of beta are lifting through uh, central parts of Louisiana right now, so it's still a couple hundred miles away and will continue to pump moisture towards us through the overnight hours tonight and especially tomorrow. Heaviest rain tomorrow looks to happen between sunrise and middle of the afternoon, so that's when you'll need to be in the most alert for flooding. Here's a quick peek with computer modeling and you just see a whole lot of the same, right? Wave after wave, pockets of heavier downpours, pockets where it gets a little bit lighter with the bulk of the heavy rain concentrated for folks south. We should dry off by sunset on Thursday and things are looking mostly dry to start your weekend. A couple showers peak in Sunday, Monday with some cooler air set for next week. Stay with us, lots more on News Channel 5 at 4.